Well, here's an update. It's Tuesday, November 13th. Uh, we've replaced the top piece, putting the new gasket glue in. Uh, we have started to put the line in from the top. Uh, now we are working on the bottom part of the line, which I am working on in this nasty 30 degree weather right now. And as you can see, we've replaced the fitting that goes in the exhaust, which I had to order. And uh, $7 was uh, a lot cheaper than spending 30 at the dealership. So that fully works now. Now we're just tightening up the pipes to make sure that they're fully fitting and done. And then we're going to put the new exhaust back pressure sensor in, which will only take a couple minutes. Both sides have fittings. And, uh, once they're super tight, that's it. They're done. Now, now you can reinstall the new top piece with the wiring. And, uh, that should stop your, uh, pressurize issues. These trucks are notorious for for the uh, exhaust back pressure failing, which is a typical common problem, which I really don't understand on these trucks. This wouldn't be a first that I've seen it. But yeah, I'll do another video once it's completed.